Hello, this is uh, teacher Leila Taik. Uh, I am a Moroccan, I'm an EFL teacher, and also I am a, a TCLP uh, Arabic exchange teacher, teacher uh, program uh, of teachers of critical languages program uh, implemented by American Council. Uh, actually, I'm here in, uh, at Brooklyn Emerging Leaders Academy High School uh, to teach uh, American students uh, here in Brooklyn Arabic language as a critical language. I want that uh, this uh, grant uh, scholarship uh, um, for, in a partnership with my Moroccan in Ministry of Education, uh, with the, in partnership with the, uh, the American Council, and I was lucky to uh, to live this experience and uh, come to uh, the USA and start. Uh, this experience of uh, uh, teaching and living uh, and uh, immersing in uh, the American community. Uh, I would like uh, to um, thank my uh, American community here, my uh, school principal, uh, Mrs. Nisha and Mrs. Shannon, that they really uh, accepted me among them. Uh, Bella School is really uh, a very uh, a welcoming uh, community. Um, I would like to share with you uh, my experience as uh, an, uh, an, a teacher coming from Morocco here in uh, uh, USA and how I made uh, the difference uh, in this uh, new uh, life in, uh, at Brooklyn and in a, a high school, uh, in an American high school teaching American students uh, a language which is very challenging, which is Arabic. Um, at the beginning, it was not very easy to teach the students from scratch. I started from August uh, till now. Uh, and uh, uh, till now, I can say that my students are really spelling uh, Arabic language. They can make uh, a small community can communicate in uh, using Arabic. Uh, it's good for me because I found this school also will come in all the, the ethnicities and the diversities. Same in my country, Morocco, the, where I come from. Uh, Morocco is a diverse country that is accepting uh, all the differences. Uh, it was really um, um, enriching to my the professional development experience uh, since I learned even from my students. I learned from my co-workers, I learned from my American community. Uh, the difference that I'm really making is that uh, I am not just teaching them Arabic, but I am uh, giving them part of my culture. Uh, I, we, I do, since I not just uh, part of, of my mission here uh, through, due, through my program is also to introduce my Moroccan culture. I did uh, with my students the Hanna thing. We also, uh, I introduced them to the Moroccan traditions, uh, the uh, touristic places, the food of Morocco. We even pre we went uh, in a camp with my students and. I really teach them, or we uh, interact in real life situation, not just uh, uh, I make students communicate in Arabic and write it, uh, uh, use them in real life. For example, when we went in a camp, we uh, prepared the Moroccan tea with mint, and they use Arabic when they are preparing or some, doing something in the culture. Uh, I really felt that I am uh, making uh, uh, something new, something innovative, something that is creative with my American students and uh, they are really welcoming me and I am really happy to have this experience as an exchange teacher. Uh, the thing that helped me also that I was running a, a culture exchange uh, club uh, my project called the Collaborative Culture Exchange Collaborative Project, doing 
They, I engaged my students to write uh, letters and also to uh, interact through uh, the Flipgrid um, platform uh, with the American students from North Carolina and also from uh, back to school in Morocco. So they introduced themselves, my students introduced themselves in Arabic and uh, they uh, talked about the celebrations in, uh, in America and also my, the, the Moroccan students, they talked about the Moroccan traditions, which is good to know about, not just about the language and learn it, but also the culture behind it. Um, so yes, uh, I think yes, now I'm living a great experience about that. What helps me most of it that I am, uh, I won uh, for several times the Microsoft Innovative Educator Experts that helped me uh, teach these American students using many platforms like Flipgrid, like um, Wakelet, like uh, Microsoft Teams. So we, uh, that helps really to use technology uh, with uh, a foreign language like Arabic. You know, it's challenging uh, to start uh, something new uh, from scratch. But now I am proud of myself since I built my, uh, an Arabic curriculum for this school that I will leave behind when I go uh, back to my country. Uh, so I really congratulate myself on that and uh, I'm happy that I am uh, useful to my uh, uh, American uh, uh, program and also to my American community here and my school, host school. Thank you.